Alright everybody, I wanted to do a short um, video here on how to um, get the videos off of your portable um, camcorder, um, flip, uh, the Sony versions, whatever you got onto iMovie um, and how to start uh, editing those. Um, what I do is here is my uh, iMovie um, and what I do first is I go up to uh, file and I go to import from camera and that will bring up my uh, clips that are on my flip and then what I will do here um, so I will select the ones that are unchecked the ones I guess I should say that I don't want and leave the ones that I do want checked I'm just going to do a couple of them here um, so that it doesn't take a real long time uh, we'll do uh, three of them here um, let's do this one it's a little shorter and we will import the checked ones it's going to ask you to create a folder I'm going to do just a test uh, we'll call it test one folder and import those this takes a few minutes uh, depending on how many you're importing these are man, about a minute and a half a piece all right, uh, looks like we're on the third clip now. Um, this one is uh, getting imported into iMovie and then we'll be able to start uh, doing some editing. Uh, this one's about a minute and seven seconds, so it's about a little over halfway right now. All right, um, so now it's generating thumbnails uh, for those um, event or those clips, I should say. It imported four minutes and 44 seconds from three clips and then we can hit done here and then right over here in test one those are the clips right here that we just um, imported and you can go through there um, you can play anything you find it in? later you can play uh, test everything I guess before you make decision on what parts of the clip you're going to use. I would just want a solid pink. What, uh, what you got to do to start your project where you can add multiple clips together and do your um, transitions and all that stuff is you will go up here to new project and we'll call this new project test one as well and you can also do themes up here or trailers We'll just do a, a generic, um, just the regular generic uh, theme where you have all different transitions, text. Uh, you got different music to choose from. If you need music. What you do um, when you're going to start a video, what I do a lot of times is I'll start with text. Um, let's say if you want to put your title of your video, what I will do is I will grab it out of here, over here in your um, text box uh, let's pick this one and what you do if this doesn't show up when you first uh, log on all of those your uh, utilities as far as transitions text music pictures all that are right over here in this right hand um, right in the middle of the screen here so you click on the T for text and that gives you your options drag those over um, you can hit spacebar um, to uh, play what we'll do, <clears throat> we'll change this right here just to test one as well. And you can change your fonts by clicking on font, different types of fonts here. Uh, you can do different colors. We'll choose this blue here. Uh, let's go with this uh, size font. Hit done. Hit done here. And then that comes up. It can be your intro to your video. Um, also, we can. Um, open up the music and you've got a lot of preset music in here from Apple um, that you can use. It's a little better than using um, your iTunes music. If you're using those, you're going to run into a lot of uh, copyright problems there. Um, what you can do is come down through here. Let's find something. Um, section 
drag it over to the beginning, grab the end of it, extend it out, and we will put, we're going to open a transition. Uh, let's do, it's like a page opening right here beside that. And we'll leave the music out for there. And let's go up here and say we want, uh, we just want a little bit of this clip right here. Just select that, grab it, drag it down here. Um, I do a lot of times too, uh, so you can hear the audio better. Is you can go to audio adjustments right here, and it's used, always at 100% preset. So you can grab that and drag it over to 500 or anywhere between there, but 500 is good and loud. I'm looking at bedding. And you got some good uh, volume there. Um, let's go over here, and we will grab, uh, let's see here. Grab this clip right here, drag it down, and let's go right here, and we'll grab a little clip right here, drag it down. So these are all out of different uh, clips from the uh, flip cam that I'm using. All three of these are different, so you're going to play this. Uh, just going to transition right into others. You can use the transitions over here as well in between those clips. She'll be here before we know it. But you can do just a straight transition there too. Um, then you can put, um, if you want to put a little credit here at the end, call this the end of your film. Use this same ending. We'll just put the end. Here, right at the end, uh, just something generic to let you know how everything works. You go back to the beginning. Space bar. I'm, I'm looking at bedding. How you find it? Skip if you need to. She'll be here before we know it. And then you got the end. Then this is just a short demonstration. You can make the videos um, as long as you need them. Uh, when you get done. You're going to want to go up here and you're going to finalize the project. Um, I'm going to do this right now because it takes a while, but when you do that, um, it'll go through and finalize the project. And then after that, once it's done finalizing, you can come over here to share. Um, you can go straight to YouTube, Facebook. Uh, there's some other things here too um, that, that I don't use, but I use primarily YouTube and Facebook. Um, so yeah, that's uh, pretty much um, how you do a simple uh, import and edit a very simple uh, movie on iMovie.